Hey guys, it's Jason Hevel here in my new apartment. Uh, today I went to the library to pick out some movies. And I rented this one movie I watched called Cody the Robo Sapien. It's from Anchor Bay Entertainment. Um, it's a movie about this uh, toy company called Kinotech, who Alan played by um, David Eisenberg. He played in um, Chicago Fire and Sex in the City. Um, he's the owner, he's the inventor of this, of these robots it's called Robo Sapiens. And they're designed to be like superheroes. They help like people out and, and um, his boss, forget the boss's name, but he wants to create these robots to become like evil and like search and destroy missions. And so he follows, fires Alan. And so Alan decides to delete the Robo Sapien files and he escapes with one of his Robo Sapiens that he called his son. And I forget what they originally called this Robo Sapien. And so they're Alan's getting hunted down by the security of Kinotech and you you find and then you run it and then you they introduce this character named um Henry who's an who's a boy, trying to, I don't know, he's a, maybe, middle school boy, middle school, like, 6th, 7th, or 8th, 8th eighth grade boy, who's a big, and he's really big in the science, and he wins first prize in the science fair, and he gets picked on a lot by his sister, and these boys in school, and one night he's walking home from school, and he gets picked on by these two kids, and they smash his science fair trophy and so he runs into the dumpster to hide from the the bullies and he finds the Robo Sapien that's all broken to pieces that the security from Kinotech is looking for so he takes over Robo Sapien and he finds out that the Robo Sapien can actually talk and so they they become friends Henry calls his the Robo Sapien Cody because Cody Sounds like the the code that Robo Sapien was registered by. So them two become friends, and his family becomes in love with Cody. And Cody's helped out the family by decorating the house, repairing repairing the sister's car, who was like trashed. And did you like the movie? And so basically that's all the movie's about, and then they run into Alan, and, you know, he finds out that and Cody and Henry have a beloved friendship, and basically at the end they all, like, they become a family. Um, my review of the movie was pretty good. It's kind of reminded me of, like, an E.T. kind of film where the boy becomes a friend with an alien, and, you know, them two become best friends. It's It's... It says it's produced by the producers of X Men and Spider Man. Um, I think it was it was it was a pretty good family film. Um, it it has the star of the little boy from Blindside, Jay Het Heard, um, does the voice of Cody, and the mother's played by Penelope Ann Miller, and also the guy who played in Sex and the City and. Um, Chicago Fire. I don't know who the boy Henry was played by, but I mean it, it's a it's a direct to DVD only like 85 minute long movie. So if you have any kids or you like sci-fi kids films, definitely check this one out. And that's the, my movie review of today. Check out for more videos for indie wrestling Q and A and movie reviews coming soon.